In Lake Tahoe, people are still dealing with all the snow that's been piling up over the, over the past few weeks. And now we're learning it's having a big impact on tourism. ABC 7 News reporter Glory Rodriguez joins us with more on that. Good morning, Reggie. Storms have dumped massive piles of snow on cabins and businesses. Some are literally buried and others are struggling to operate. And that's causing tourism to take a huge hit. As you can see here, many buildings in Lake Tahoe are covered in snow. And that means customers can't even get inside some restaurants, shops and hotels. Residents and business owners have been busy digging out just so they can access their properties. Zaz Lakefront is a restaurant in Tahoe City. The owner says this winter has been tougher than even COVID was. I think we were down 25% uh, January. Uh, we were down like 33% in February and we're down so far this month, we're down about 38%. So this month, March is usually one of the biggest months of the year. You know, when you look at the numbers, it's really hard. The owner has been running the business since the late 80s, but the storms have left ski resorts in Northern California anticipating a big boost in business. The Palisades Tahoe Resort says it had to close on multiple occasions to dig out, but that could translate to more days of business. The ski resort is extending its season to Memorial Day. Kumasi. Wow.